Hey, I got a question for all y'all Floyd haters out there right now. You know, y'all hating on Floyd because he's he's still talking that Gucci. You know what I mean? Uh, he's still talking that I love that Gucci shit, even though they clearly are are have lost their fucking minds when it comes to what the hell is appropriate material, right? So let me ask y'all a question, right? Y'all calling him a sellout. Y'all calling him a time. Y'all saying he ain't down for the cause. Y'all calling him a house nigga. You're saying that he's just making money for the master. He's doing all of these things, right? He's doing all of these things. That's against the cause. That's against the code. We should band together. We should stick together. We should show this black love and unity. He's no longer one of us. Boy, Cop Floyd, um, how'd y'all's NFL team do this year? Huh? 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 How was that Super Bowl that everybody was talking about was so boring that I missed because I was boycotting, right? There is no difference from what the NFL is doing and what Gucci and Prada is doing. Don't try to separate the two because it's convenient for you right? You're supposed to do things, the same thing you want him to do, the same thing you're screaming at the top of your lungs for him to do, all of the names that you're calling him for not being down for the cause. Look in the mirror. You had the exact same opportunity. For months, football goes on for months, 17, 18, 19 games, weeks. You had plenty of time to get all of this priority shit that you got for Floyd's life, you had a lot more time to get that shit together than he had. What's your problem? But now you wanna call names. Now you wanna try to segregate. Now you wanna try to be down. You can't do that. Either you're all the way down or you ain't down at all. There is no in-between when it comes to our people and our pride. There is no in-between when it comes to racism. Either you tolerate it or you don't. Either you're down or you're not. So how, how, how'd, your team, how'd your team do? You know how your team did because you was watching that shit. Don't be mad at Floyd because he's doing the same thing you was doing, just in a different level. Black people, we've got to do better. We've got to have a better understanding of who we are and what we want. Because as long as we're doing shit like this, as long as we're supporting on one end and wanting to fight when it's our own personal cause, that's not how it works. That's why it's not going away. And that's why these white people don't care that we hooping and hollering because we're picking and choosing. Don't act like Floyd's any different than you when you were sitting on the couch on Sunday cheering, clapping, applauding, crying, laughing, getting all emotional over your team. That's what he's doing. He's happy. He's emotional. He's happy over his stuff, just like you was happy when Odell Beckham Jr. caught that touchdown. When Cam Newton ran for that first down. When A.J. Green caught that ball. He's just as happy as you were. Don't flip the script now that you're far removed from the NFL season on your way home from the Super Bowl talking about fuck Floyd. Oh no, it don't work like that. If it's fuck him, then it's fuck you. Make up your mind. Make up your mind, black America. What do you want to do? Because as long as you're being a hypocrite, we ain't getting no help. We're gonna continue to see blackface. We're gonna continue to have our players blacklisted for trying to defend our rights and speak up for us because we have no voice. They're speaking up for us. Cap spoke up for you because you have no voice. He put his family, his welfare, his name on the line for you because you are too small to have a voice. And you turn around and stab him in the back, but then going to get mad at Floyd for doing the same thing you do. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. Do better. Do better, black people. What's wrong with y'all? And you wonder why they don't care. We don't even know what we're doing. Be ashamed of yourself if you're mad at Floyd. 
Year two, boycott coming up. Ridiculous. Ridiculous.